and welcome back to my channel. So if you guys are new here, my name is Kristen and I'm kind of slightly addicted to everything in The Sims 4. But for today's video, we're actually going to be doing a townie makeover for summer holiday. And whenever I am doing these makeovers, I like to make sure I do not touch anything to do with like her body shape, her size, or like any of her face structure. So I like to limit myself to doing like hair, makeup, clothing, and just as if like maybe she was to get like a normal makeover because I wanted to have that same look so that I can place her back into my game kind of like a glow up if you will so anyways if there is anything for custom content that maybe you really like and want to put into your game make sure to check out the tumblr link down in the description I always make sure that if I add any custom content to my game I always reblog everything there so right off I did use the apricot or apricot skin overlay and the meteor um, default eyes so I will make sure to leave a link to those um, separately down in the description as well just because I know that they are kind of very distinct in her makeover so this was definitely a lot of fun it's a new series that I am starting the other one that I did was actually for candy bear so if you do like watching these townie makeovers definitely head over check that out I'll leave a link for that video down in the description as well so also let me me know down in the comments which townie would you like to see me give a makeover to next and I'm actually thinking I'm gonna have to go on Tumblr and do a little bit of custom content shopping because I'm kind of starting to get limited. I feel like I am kind of like using the same custom content over and over again. So, I mean, it's been only like a couple weeks since I actually have like put different things into my game. I kind of go in spurt. Sometimes I'll like spend an entire evening on Tumblr, like three or four hours with like a movie on and I'll get like this huge haul of custom content and I'll go into my folder and like remove everything and start over so I feel like that's gonna have to happen again soon so definitely follow me over on tumblr and maybe I'll get a little heads up and see what I get before I actually put it here on YouTube so I really hope that you guys like how this video turned out these are always so much fun to do and I don't really put too many like makeovers and create a sims here on my channel so when I do I have an absolute blast and also make sure give this video a very big thumbs up if you do like how it turned out and if you are not already subscribed definitely consider subscribing to my channel I do post regularly here and I really hope that I get to see you guys in my next video bye guys